Hello everyone, welcome back. I tried to video, or I tried to record a video on uh, my newer phone, but uh, I have no storage, which is bullshit. So I'm just gonna repeat everything that I said and just hope that I don't lose my fucking mind, okay? So number one, if you're new here, thank you very much for stopping in today. Uh, I really do appreciate it. And uh, number two, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and click the subscribe button. Number, it helps me out a lot. It helps me out a lot. Uh, it helps the channel out a lot. And uh, it gives me a reason to keep uploading. But, uh, you know, there's a few days left before Christmas. And, uh, you know, throw a dog a bone. Okay? Go ahead and subscribe. Let's see if we can hit 300 subscribers before the end of the year. Can we do that? Thank you, guys. I knew I could count on you. Uh, but I really can't tell what's being recorded right now because, uh, you know, I'm using the back facing camera. So bear with me. So this video is about security cameras, okay? And I'm not, this isn't really a review. This is just me talking about a security camera that I personally own and have used and have experience with. And that is this brand right here. Gals, Ghouls, Jaws, however you want to say it, uh, G double O W L S. Okay, this is a security camera that has supposedly 10 1080p uh, resolution and then a speaker on the back so you uh, can talk to uh, whoever is in front of this thing. My wife bought this for our pets, okay? We have a, a pet room that we uh, put the dogs up in. And, uh, you know, it, it, it's, it's, she wanted this, so if we go on vacation and like we have somebody come and, you know, uh, let the dogs out and that kind of stuff. Uh, this, we usually have somebody, you know, babysit the dogs while we're away. So, just, just so you know. And that's where this comes in. You know, that way we know that they're not always in their cage and, and, and all that good stuff. So, you know, and, and it was a good investment. However, here's my gripes, okay? I'm not going to go into too much detail because I, I will say this. This thing was relatively cheap. I feel like we've got our money's worth. But I, it's time to move on to a better indoor security camera. Uh, you know, one that's... Pluggable. I don't want one hanging from a ceiling. I already have those out of my house. I don't want them in my house. So I just wanted one that plugs into the wall. Okay? So you have to download an app for this thing. And there you can do a full 360 via the app. And uh, this thing goes up and down. You can make that bitch go up and down. And, uh, you know, like I said, talk to whoever... Uh, it's got the reset button. It uh, you know it's USB Type C, and uh, it, you know with the it comes with the charger or uh, you know a, a power cord and all that good stuff. Uh, it even has a daytime sensor, so it knows when to switch from uh, you know uh, regular you know regular picture to to night vision, and uh, the night vision is pretty cool and it's pretty clear. The thing isn't terrible, per se. The picture's not terrible, but I feel like 1080p is a little bit of a stretch. Maybe 720. Uh, the audio quality is not the best either, but it's 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 just good enough that you can understand audibly what people are saying. Uh, it it definitely you know how like sometimes when you're hearing somebody on the phone, you can definitely tell. Like, oh, this is so-and-so. I can recognize their voice. If you speak through this thing, I, I, I mean, my wife would talk through it just to test it out. And I swear to God, I could not, her voice just did not sound the same. Very, very odd. But uh, the thing was made in China. It, it you know, and it, I'm not bitching about it too much, like I said, because it was cheap. I feel like, you know, I, before I started the video, I wanted to make sure that I had my facts right. So I wanted to get a price on this thing, and I, I really couldn't find a singular price for one of them. But I know you can buy a two-pack for less than 80 bucks. So 
that's really not that bad, okay? That's actually really cheap. And, uh, you know, it gets the job done, but here's my problem, okay? I would get home from work, and this thing would be disconnecting and, and reconnecting to the Wi-Fi. It, had, it has connectivity issues. Uh, that's kind of annoying, you know, because my Wi-Fi is really good, and I pay a lot for it. So, I know it's not my Wi-Fi, but this thing just, you know, every, like, it, per hour, I would say this thing... If you have it plugged up, would uh, disconnect and reconnect up to five times, which is kind of annoying, and it picks up exactly where it's left off. It's not like you had to reset anything or anything like that, so it's not that big of a deal. It's just an inconvenience, and, and it, it's annoying. And also, the thing would power down and then power back on. The first time I ever heard it do that was in the middle of the night, and it scared the living shit out of me. I almost came out of my bedroom, guns blazing, because it was just so weird. And so just, if you buy this thing, just be aware of that, okay? Just be aware. That's all I'm saying. Uh, don't say I didn't warn you. Uh, now, and it could just be this one. Sometimes you get kind of faulty products, you know, and, and that happens. Some, like with my Goxa Wii rotary tool that people so very much hate. Uh, that thing's a piece of shit, okay? But it's almost like 50-50. I got people that tell me that they love theirs and theirs runs perfectly and then you got mine. So, you know, quality varies and it does. You know, and in 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 a world, in a consumer world, quality does it, quality is important, and you know it needs to be steady. So, you know, it's it's kind of I may I'm gonna say unpredictable quality, maybe I don't know, but other than the connectivity issues, I I could have made this thing work, but unfortunately, I'm tired of hearing the damn thing reconnecting. And, and disconnecting and, and powering on and off. I just don't want to listen to it no more. So I'm getting a new one. So uh, let me know in the comments below what's a good brand, you know? And, and why should I get it? How much is it? Where can I find it? But uh, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, this may be the last video uh, in 2021. Who knows? But I really do appreciate you guys stopping in, okay? I love you. I really do really, really do. Anyway, I'll see you.